Hi everybody, so I wanted to make a video today about uh, ionic foot detoxes. First of all, why you would do one. Um, second of all, what is it and what is it for? So how could it benefit you? So this is my little helper, Ellie. She's gonna help me to talk about the foot detoxes today. So what a foot detox is, is I'm on an ionic foot detox bath is you're going to use one of these. This is just a foot basin. So you could use anything that you had that would fit your feet. So I just use this and I put liners on this. So that way I don't have to wash this every single time I use it. However, uh, if I had it just for myself, I might just clean it out every time because it's not that big of a deal. But anyway, so this is the foot basin this is what I have actually the machine so it isn't just the foot basin that you soak your feet in it actually has um, some electric components to it and then this is called an array and this is what actually does uh, something in the water so this actually goes it plugs into the machine and it goes into the basin like this an ionic foot detox bath is a true detox. I really like to use this detox because it uh, is really, really gentle. So it is really good if you've never done a detox or a cleanse before, or if you're a little intimidated by them. Um, if you're elderly, if it's a child, or you have an A blood type, uh, sometimes when they cleanse, it's a little bit more uh, abrupt than, say, somebody with an O blood type. So there are a few people who aren't eligible for a foot detox, and that will be people that have pacemakers. Uh, they have had an organ transplant, or you are pregnant or nursing. The reason why you would want to detox is because our body accumulates different types of toxins every day through eating, drinking, breathing, as well as exposures to medications, chemicals, toxic environments, um, etc. So these toxins, they cause cells to die faster, which lead to premature aging and diseases, all that other kind of stuff. So what the foot detox does is this the array it goes in we put it in the water and it will emit positive and negative ions into the water those positive and negative ions go through the over the 4,000 pores on your feet they go through the pores of the feet and then the circulatory system and the lymphatic system they carry them to where they can find oppositely charged toxins in the body and they will help to neutralize them so that way they can be eliminated more easily so everything moves through the blood and the limbs so everything is it goes really quickly kind of like a well-oiled highway with no accidents so kind of like the cells are cars and what happens is is when you have a toxin or you have a cell that wasn't formed correctly or anything like that is instead of them moving freely like this they kind of move a little bit slower and so what, the, so what the, the positive and negative ions that are emitted through the array, when they go through the pores of the feet, they go and find those ones that are moving a little bit slower and they neutralize them so that way the body can eliminate them more quickly and efficiently. So the water in the, in the basin will change colors no matter what because you are changing the frequency of the water. It'll be a light, light yellow. Anything that changes after that is going to be indicating what the body needs most help with detoxing at that moment. So after you are done with the detox, which for healthy adults is normally 30 minutes of a detox with your feet in the water, and after that, uh, sometimes people can have a slight headache because it is a detox, but majority of the time it's not. And if you do have that happen, then you just drink some water and maybe eat something if you need to. But some people say that it helps them to sleep better that night. There have been other people that have mentioned that it helps their lymphs. They've had lymph that was swollen and it kind of helped to decrease the inflammation in there. I don't, I'm not making any claims on as far as what the foot detox would do for you. You will just have to have one to find out. So what the detox does is it stimulates 
the body's eliminative organs to work more efficiently. So this is a good time to do that when you are doing your yearly cleanse. If you do a yearly cleanse and if you don't, I highly recommend that. Uh, it's great if you are having an acute illness. So if you are not feeling well under the weather, like a cold or sinus congestion or anything like that, the body's organs can become energized and they stimulate to function optimally. So the body rids itself of these toxins through its normal processes of urination, defecation, and sweating. So what the detox does is it helps to stimulate that. What I do like to let everybody know is that whenever you do a detox, you detox the bad things, but you also detox some of the good things. So I highly recommend adding minerals after every session. One of my favorites is Nature Sunshine Ionic Minerals or they also have mineral chi tonic. Both of those are going to help replace the minerals that have been depleted through the detox. This is going to make your body work more efficiently and it can help uh, the way you feel possibly if it's, if it's not ideal after doing a detox. So, so the, the ionic detox has been known to remove toxins, free radicals, and body waste products that can cause health problems. Uh, it can also improve body alkalinity, relieve pain, tension, including headaches, uh, purify the blood and the lymph, increase peripheral circulation, stimulate and balance the immune system, enhance nutrient absorption, reduce inflammation and unwanted fluid retention, help clear up skin, assist in weight loss, slow down the aging, improve body flexibility, quicken recovery time from disease or injury, increase oxygen in the body, rejuvenate and energize your whole body or possibly even improve sleep. So if you haven't done it already, feel free to make an appointment with us to come get your foot detox done and we look forward to seeing you then.